Well, both of them are bad, uh, implying that misogyny is worse. It's kind of silly, because both can do a lot of damage. I, an argument could be made that misogyny does a lot more damage, because a mere accusation from a woman can ruin a man's reputation. Like, a woman's word is, in general, valued way more than a man's. Prime example, look at Johnny Depp. His reputation was tarnished by a mere accusation and he had to go years just to prove his innocence based upon a woman's word. And he lost everything he had, essentially. And it took him years to recover. And then, also, this... Thin, oh, this little quote or whatever always gets repeated and regurgitated. People rarely have their own original thought. It's just really silly to hate someone based upon their gender or what's between their legs or based upon their skin color. And then you actually look at the actual evidence, often it's quite the opposite of what is being stated here. I'm not saying that misogyny doesn't exist, of course, it does. Misogyny exists. Misandry exists. Misandry, however, is more often accepted. Pe people get away with it more often than not, and they can ruin someone's life. Misogyny, more often than not, gets actually hated upon, and rightly so, but... You guys have to stop being so ideologically possessed and brainwashed. Like, I'll just ask you where you get your ideas from. Chances are you just get it from someone's comment and you believe it or you read some bullshit blog and then you don't really look at actual historical evidence and facts. I'm not trying to talk down upon you, but like, actually analyze what you're saying. One of your things you said was, oh, white men are in positions of power so they can't be discriminated against. It's just silly.